When the Legends Football League came to Omaha, people weren't exactly sure what to think. Well, the Omaha heart is lingerie football, but don't let that fool you. These ladies are gamers. It used to be the name. It used to be lingerie football. Now it's Legends now it's football. Legends. And two, right. of the, uh, two of the players join us this morning, uh, Jacqueline Good and Nikki Bernhardt. And Coach, uh, Coach is here, too. Kayla Good, good to see you. Thanks, Thanks for stopping in. Thanks so, li li listen, how did, how did you all get started in, in football uh, for the two of you? Because you're playing, but you really had no background in football, did you? Yeah, I think for women's sports, after you're done with schooling, there's not much there. So for me, I was like, I didn't know what I wanted to do, but I wanted to stay competitive. And so when they announced that they were coming to Omaha, I just got super excited. What yeah, sports in, did right? you play? Uh, I did softball, basketball, track, and wrestling. How about you, Nikki? Um, I played pretty much everything, but in college I played soccer. And so after that, one day I was at the gym and I ran into one of the players. And I was like, oh my God, this is awesome. Like, let me come out for your team. And she was like, heck yeah, come out here. So. so what did you think of it when you got on the field and you put the pads on and you start hitting? What, I mean, was, it's different than soccer. <laughs> it's a little different. Mike different. knows. He's played soccer. <laughs> he play soccer. It's different. It's still extremely competitive, so it's awesome. I mean, anyone that is athletic would enjoy it. It's hard hitting, yeah. so, you know, it takes a toll on your body, but it's awesome. It's well, see, that's the part I wouldn't like, the hitting. <laughs> did it take a while to get adjusted to the hitting? I like hitting, so <laughs> no, I guess I'm the only one. <laughs> so we've got to point out something obvious here. We have a player and a coach with the same last name. This is not your stepdad, I've heard. <laughs> <laughs> no, you guys are married, right? Uh, and you're the and you're the defensive coordinator too. I am. Uh, I am. It's you know, it's when we're on the field, it's strictly business, and uh, you know, football stays on the field. When we get home. It's completely different. <laughs> <laughs> I know. Well, Kayla, you, you're, you're a football guy. You played college football. And so why did you want to uh, coach uh, the Legends Football League? Uh, actually, the head coach, he and I had played together in college against each other and then uh, played together on the Omaha Beef. He contacted me kind of out of the blue when, when the team came up, and uh, he asked me if I wanted to help out. And then I've, I've kind of been helping ever since. Can we talk, let's talk about something obvious here. Your uniforms oh, the don't really the uniforms? look like the average. Is it difficult to play with that much skin exposed? And how did you feel about like going into this? Like, I got to play the game, I got to be competitive, but I also get to wear this, which gives the fans a little something to look at. You know, for me personally, I, I don't even think about it. Mm -hmm. So when I'm out there, I'm competing. I'm not thinking about what I'm wearing, how I look. I'm reading the ball, I'm watching for the next play. So, um, I know it draws fans in, but that's not what it's about for us girls that are actually participating in it. I mean, no, yeah. you guys are competing hard. Yeah. Yeah, don't let the uniforms fool you. I mean, these NFL players, they're, they've got, you know, they got the pads all over their shin, their, their hips, and I mean, Kayla, you know, I mean, they're not wearing the pads like they are in the NFL here. Yeah, I, I feel for them, because when, when we played it, we padded up about everything, and they're out there playing without anything. Some so. monster bruises, I'm sure. Oh, yeah. <laughs> what, what are your expectations for the season? How did you guys do last year, and, and how are you looking to, to, to grow on that from this year? Uh, they've had a tough go the last few years with injuries and coaching staff, and this is just going to be a new era for Omaha Heart. We got returning girls from last year and vets from previous seasons that are coming back, and we're just going to show everyone that we can play and go back to the basics. If somebody's a fan of the game of football, how is what they see out there at the arena gonna, gonna look? Is it the same game? Are there the same rules? It's the same idea with less rules, I would say. What um, do you mean, like less rules? Uh, like how, how does it compare to regular football that we're used to? It's arena style football, so it's not like your traditional NFL. And then um, I wouldn't, that's a loaded question because it is females <laughs> playing the sport and we have less pads. So it's just a different, it's same hard hitting, mm -hmm. it's football handoffs and schemes that you're seeing, but it's just done by women. Gotcha. Okay, let's get into uh, what, what can fans expect this coming game? And we'll put the information for the first game coming up of the season. But what can fans expect if they've never been to a game? To be entertained, to watch girls just go all out and play football. Awesome. Well, there's some uh, information at the bottom of the screen. You can see the website there. We'll also link you back on our website, omahamorningblood.com. Check them out for the season. Also, a Groupon discount right now. If you want to check it out for the first time, maybe you've never been, you can look for that online, save some money on tickets. 
uh, check out the website, get to know about the girls, their positions, their backgrounds, and uh, go support your heart, Omaha. And the first game is April 21st, mm -hmm. right? Friday? Friday, April 21st. Yep, that's, that's this Friday. Your, it's this Friday. Time flies when you're having fun, <laughs> right? Thanks, Good luck. Guys. Thanks, ladies. Thank you. Okay. The